this is where the connection is going to be from the old to the new. It's a two-story connection, needless to say. It's done with some ramping and some stairs. This is probably one of the most difficult engineering parts of the project that we had to have because, of course, you're connecting the elevation of the new structure, which is several feet higher than the elevation of the old structure. So this is where you know our folks from Challenge came on and, and did a real good job for us in design and engineering with our architects to try to put this together. And again, this is the lifeline between the old building and the new building for our students. Currently, we're inside the new library and media center. Um, right now, what these gentlemen are doing is bringing in all the new furniture, the new bookcases. Uh, our plan is, over the Christmas holiday, that we will take all the old books and materials out of the old library and roll them right over here and set them right into the stacks as so we're ready to go. Rolling. Currently you're in, inside one of the three new art rooms that we built. We're very excited about this opportunity because we, we have built three of these rooms. Uh, two of them happen to be uh, just adjacent to an overhang outside so at some point in time if the kids were able to take desks and tables to go outside and do some work in the nice weather they could do that. So everything that's been put into the building has to be made in America, also has to be very, very efficient in the way that, the way that it's built and, and the way that it uses energy. The lead process is something that we're very proud of. I think it's good for the environment and it's going to be very, very good, good for the community. Now we're in the auxiliary gymnasium. Currently, as you see, they're, they're going to be putting the, the, the mats on the walls. We do have a basketball court in here, but this will primarily in the wintertime be used for our wrestling team to practice, but also as an area for adaptive phys ed. Uh, it gives our staff members another room to use besides the main gym. If there's a small group of students that are going to come in here and do some other type of fitness activities, they can, they're going to be able to do this in the auxiliary gymnasium. Okay.